What's going on guys? Peter here with One Guy One Globe and in this week's Two Minute Tuesday, I'm going to be covering off the TD Aeroplan Visa Infinite card. So what's going on guys? We're going to go right into to the bonus structure by throwing two minutes on the clock and covering off that TD is going to give you 10,000 Aeroplan points just for signing up for the card as well in your first 90 days as long as you spend a thousand dollars they're going to give you a buddy pass for Air Canada which would cover off North America at zero dollars similar to companion voucher with WestJet as well as they're going to waive your first fee for your annual rate and they're going to give you an additional 15,000 Aeroplan bonus points on top of that for that thousand dollars in purchases. So some of the other perks with this card is that if you do travel with Air Canada, you do get your first bag and up to seven other people on the same reservation for free. As well, if you are a Nexus card user, every five years, they will reimburse you your card, uh, essentially your card fee is at 50 US dollars every five years itself. So when it comes down to the earn rate, you're gonna earn 1.5 points for every dollar you spend on gas, grocery, and Air Canada purchases, and then one point for everything else. When it comes down to the insurance, it is gonna be pretty standard across the board with the Visa Infinite Pro Program, you're going to get your cancellation, your interruption, your flight delay, your medical, and your car rental coverage. So in 2021, is this card even really worth it? With the 25,000 welcome bonus points that is given to you right off the bat, with well, within the first 90 days, it is that nice, um, really instant redemption rather than spreading across the year like some other cards are doing, similar like American Express or even RBC, as well as that initial buddy pass. That buddy pass you're only going to get once. You're not going to get it every year like you do with uh, the Western World Elite MasterCard. And that first year waived is nice for if you are going to turn this card as an example. So if you are a TD client and already are with them, it is the card to consider maybe just getting, having it for that year, getting that uh, points and then just dumping the card. If you're not a TD client, it's not really worth it because is it really going to be something you're going to stick with going the long term? You don't earn at a great rate really with that 1.5 percent so i would consider just look at other cards however for the initial introductory offer it is a decent offer uh at least if you do travel within north america hey thanks for sticking around to the end of the video if you liked it let me know in the comments below which card i should cover off next week as well as hitting the like button it really helps me out in bringing helpful and informative travel related information to you as well please consider subscribing for future videos every tuesdays and saturdays and i'll see you all in the next one